cheated, lied to, or tricked, she's tackling every opportunity to make something that went wrong right. Better Call Bacon is on your side. When a Pinellas Park-based travel company abruptly closed in June, hundreds of customers were out thousands of dollars. Eight on your side discovered that vendors gave refunds, but the money went straight to Advantage Cruises and Travel. Tonight, consumer investigator Shannon Banker looks into why some customers are getting money back, while others are not. When customers contacted me for help months ago, there was little hope of recovering funds. But since then, the company owners have changed course. And now, depending on your individual situation, some people are receiving some, and in some cases, all of their money back. When Advantage Cruises and Travel announced bankruptcy plans in June, customers were sent a letter from the company's attorney. In short, he wasn't issuing refunds, and they'd have to go through bankruptcy court. The Better Call Bank and Inbox was flooded with complaints from customers in Pinellas, Hillsborough, and Polk counties. Nobody will tell us anything. No one will communicate with us. But things have changed. This new email from the company's attorney shows the bankruptcy hasn't been officially filed yet. And, quote, the owners are working diligently to retrieve whatever funds they can from suppliers and are dispersing them to customers. I've heard from some who received half or even all of their money back. Unfortunately, though, there are many more, like Elizabeth Bowman and her friend Barbara Thomas. Thomas, out more than $2,100 each for a canceled bus tour to the Outer Banks of North Carolina. Vantage has sent money to some people, but not to you guys. Do you feel left out? Yes, I feel like very left out, and I'm very surprised that this all happened. Yes, I agree with her 100 percent. We had traveled with Advantage Cruises and Tours Marie and everybody for else. For years, yes. The Florida Attorney General's office tells me they have 32 complaints into this company, but calls that I've received indicate that that is only a fraction of the people who could still be waiting on refunds. Some people tell me that they have had luck with their credit card companies, so if you happen to pay with your credit card, I advise you to file a claim quickly. I'm Shannon Bacon, 8 on your side. And if you have a problem that needs solving, better call Bankin. You can reach her on Facebook at WFLA Shannon or give her a call. The number is 1-855-BANKIN.